the older and the younger. The older likes to do Tai Chi quietly in her long, hot, pink velour bathrobe in front of a lavish and colorful mural of posing women. The younger likes to walk by on the way to the pool, surveying the older with admiration. The older likes to ease into the water and hover gently, bobbing around and moving her hands easily back and forth. The younger likes to pound off her laps as fast as she can. Since this is part of her intense self-created physical training program, she uses a cane and sometimes a wheelchair. She is fighting to keep from needing a wheelchair full time and to be able to keep on choreographing and dancing. She can do 46 lengths of the 60-foot pool in 25 minutes now. She even throws in some lengths doing the butterfly for an extra challenge because she's got game. The older looks on at her admiringly and smiles at her and nods on occasions when their eyes meet. The older and the younger are both in the same aquafit class, the second aquafit poem today. The older wears plastic shower caps in hot colors and a patterned wildly colorful bathing suit in the same taste as the younger, which looks good on the older too. The younger wears a cap so tight it makes her look like she has a condom on her head. After all, she has a purple and blonde eye job to protect. She also wears surf socks, knee braces to help reduce the pain, and a wildly colorful patterned bathing suit with a built-in little skirt. The older is on the far side of the pool in the deep end, very independent and mysterious, because she's got game. The younger likes to chat with people in the shallow end before class starts. During class, she straddles the two worlds of shallow and deep, as her instructor has pointed out she likes to do. Is this a metaphor? Occasionally, she yells out jokes during the class to keep up the spirits of the myriad of older women who surround her when they start to flag, because they find the workout really challenging. This makes them laugh and keeps them going.